M. Night Shyamalan. Now, like most people, I have a hot and cold relationship with M. Night Shyamalan movies. I can never deny the fact that Sixth Sense and Unbreakable were two of my favorite films I've ever seen when I was a young kid. And by young, I mean in like 2004. However, sometimes he does not knock it out of the park like he did with those two. I would look at Glass as the most recent faux pas of his. I just thought that that movie was all over the place and not totally necessary. And of course, who could forget M. Night Shyamalan's really worst thing he's ever created, the Avatar The Last Airbender movie from whenever that came out. I don't even need to look it up. I don't want to. I don't like thinking about it. My point is, is that M. Night Shyamalan, especially in the past like five to ten years, has really sort of started to slide off and I think lean into his tropes a bit too much and it hasn't really worked out to his benefit. Oh, I just remember Old. Remember Old from 2021? That, that movie had like the worst plot twist that I've seen in a while and that's, that's saying something. All of this is to say that his new film called Trap, which is coming out this year, actually looks pretty good from everything I've seen and they just dropped the final trailer for it before it drops and people are actually saying this could be a return to form for Shyamalan and he might make something that doesn't suck again. So let's take a look at the trailer, see what we think about it, or mainly me, and you can comment and be angry. And let's see if this looks like it'll be the true return to form that Shyamalan needs, I think. Okay, here we go. Classic Shyamalan, starting with a scream in the trailer. We all know that move. I gotta go to the bathroom. Okay, Dad. Uh, the bathroom line at this event would be terrible, I'm just saying that. Psst. What's with all the police everywhere? I'm not supposed to tell. But I'm gonna tell. <laughs> right now, explicitly. You know a freaking nut job that goes around chopping people up? The feds heard that he's gonna be here today. <laughs> what, does he have a live a feed of his murder victim? This whole concert? It's a trap. Yes, yeah, so if you haven't caught on, he's the butcher that they're talking about, which is They're a terrible name for a serial exits, killer. The chicken, everyone that leaves, there's no way to get out of here. Like, let's come up with something a little bit more creative, huh? Like Billy the I've Butcher. I've felt this before. I feel out of control. Oh, shit. Okay, that's See, the first person he's brutally in injured in this. Thank you. This individual that we're searching for won't panic. Also, I want to know how they determined this serial it's killer was going to be at the concert. What's Such that plot device? Chaos. Dad, what are you doing? Pulling the fire alarm. You're acting weird. <laughs> oh, that's never a good sign. This dude is next level insane. Is that the second young girl that he is brutally injured in this trailer? What's happening? Oh, the coffee. Sorry. Sorry. That's the best disguise. No one ever thinks it's the guy with the coffee. How are you all doing? You having fun? Woo! <laughs> Come close. Okay. What's going on, Daddy? Hey. Open the goddamn door! P. I will say the whole vibe of this seems away. pretty, pretty fun. I can't stop. It's a great I'll concept. Just do this one last one. Oh. That's. Enjoy I like that concert. editing. That editing was classic Shyamalan. Pretty interesting. August 2nd, there you go. I've got to say, it, it looks like a very fun concept. And the one thing we do know about M. Night Shyamalan is he always sees his concepts all the way through to the end. My concern is that whatever that ultimate plot twist is at the end of the movie it might ruin it. You know, that's the thing with Shyamalan is sometimes when he introduces what he thinks is his cool or clever twist, it's either really interesting and cool or it's really dumb and it kind of ruins the whole movie. I would again point to old for that, personally. But I'm pretty optimistic. That actually looks sweet. People have been receiving it well. I uh, I hope Shyamalan can keep this one above water, you know? Anyway, I'm going to go take a nap. Let me know what you think in the comments, and uh, goodbye.